wardrobe is in such a state, it's disgusting. And I'm so happy. <laughs> Hello everyone, it's Monday. I'm having a little bit of a change of plan because I was getting ready to film a um, autumn capsule wardrobe but you know when you feel that you are getting a bit sick? So I had everything ready, I was at all my notes, I was pulling out clothes to start filming and then you know I don't just I don't feel like putting clothes on today is one of those days and my wardrobe is in such a state it's disgusting it gives me so much stress so I thought you know what we put on hold the autumn capsule wardrobe I filmed that in the next days and today we're gonna do a big wardrobe clear out. <laughs> we do have a video with the closet tour um, in the channel, so we can put the link here. And you can see how it looks like when it's okay. I'm gonna show you now how, what is the current situation and I'm sure you're gonna agree with me that I can't live or work like this. Ready? Are you ready? Let's say a guest come to my house, I wouldn't open this door because I would feel so ashamed so the fact that I'm showing you you guys now is like a big deal but I'm gonna do it because this is gonna give me the motivation of get the job done as soon as possible as fast as possible so ready this is it oh, I hate this I can't find anything, it's just nothing makes sense, it just, woo, you see, I'm like falling <laughs> over shoes. We went to Ikea on uh, Saturday actually and I filmed that, you're gonna see in the next vlog that is gonna go up on Wednesday. As long as I'm not a big fan of Ikea um pieces especially for the things that you actually see in your interior but for like our organizational stuff is great and i'm quite glad that all of my wardrobe cabinets are from ikea because then i could find things to fit in and i needed something to organize my jewelry and i found it and i'm gonna show you now i got these trays for all my jewelry I don't know if this is enough, eventually I'm gonna go and buy more. And then I got this, uh, that I think is actually for meant for belts, but I got this to hang all my necklaces. And normally I would ask Menno to put it up for me, but I got myself a screwdriver and girl's power, I'm gonna try and do it by myself. <laughs> Before we start, uh, if you watch my closet tour, I said already last time that I do have enough space for everything, so I don't need to, you know, put, in this case, summer stuff away. Uh, I just organize it in a different way, while, for example, like, I put more, like, below, uh, in a way that is, like, less accessible, like, summer clothes and shoes, uh, and then I bring more, like, at the front, Neatwear and things that I'm wearing more in the winter and also I'm gonna see things that I haven't been wearing in quite a long time and I'll probably get rid of them give them normally give them to charity or I sell my designer bags or shoes and uh, Let's get started. I put you on a tripod. So I have both hands Free and where do I start from? Okay, first I need to get this space free to be able to walk. Uh, so I'm gonna take everything out and then I'll start. <laughs> Little 
corridor is empty, I'm gonna go through section by section and start deciding what to keep and what to get rid of. And then when I get to the jury section, then we're gonna pull up and reorganize uh, all the jury. First section is done. I can feel my arms. Now, I'm gonna take you out of the triper in a second and show you, but I'm not really happy about one thing. If you saw my other video, normally I keep all the hangers of the same color, so like all wooden hanger together, all black hanger together, all plastic hanger together. Okay, now, I don't have any plastic hangers here, but when we've been to Ikea the other day, I bought some extra hangers and they ran out of the black ones, so I could only find the wooden color ones, so now they're all mixed up, which probably is not a big deal for loads, but it does, it makes me feel that it's not 100% perfect. Also, I think from my other closet tour, my blazer amounts considerably uh, raised. Each hanger has two blazers on it, some of them even three, which I don't really like, but well, I have to fit them all in. So I did kind of divided these by color and so these are all the blazers that I'm keeping and these are all the coats from basically the coats that I'm keeping from last winter and I have a couple of chunky cardigans here that keeps too much space if I fold them and already like trench coats here so these rather than by color are more divided by like um, so the things that I can wear now already like trench coats are here and then it goes for like more like heavier coats for winter leather jackets uh, then it, but with like fox fur and as I said cardigans so these are more like are divided not by color but by weight to be honest this is not even winter started and my coat section is already full, so let's see how we get on with that <laughs> in a month or so. And these are all my shirts, again uh, in order by color. And here, because it's a smaller space, I keep everything in um, thinner plastic hangers. And I have decided that I'm gonna put my jewel, like my necklaces thing here. I have instructions so it doesn't look that difficult, so let's get the job done. It's so complicated. Why can't like all screwdrivers just be the same size? Ah, this is becoming a comic. I have to go downstairs in the basement to look for another screwdriver and then obviously men has got like a hundred screwdrivers, like men and their screwdrivers. What did you need so many? For what? <laughs> unscrew it and do it in a different hole. Oh my god. <laughs> leave me to fashion. Like, leave me to clothes. That's it. <laughs> okay, I manage. Now this is becoming really important matter. I can't end the day without having these things up. So, first step done. Look at this. I managed all by myself. I don't need anyone. Now, let's put the first necklace up. What is this? This is a Topshop necklace. Who's gonna have the honor of being the first one that goes in my little necklace hanger? 
Perfect! I'm so happy! <laughs> now that I feel very empowered, let's do shoes. Because I've like less than an hour left, then I have to pick up Emma. I move this so you cannot see me. So then I'm gonna carry on. Tomorrow I have appointments in the city center, so uh, Wednesday or Thursday. Here I have all shoes that I currently use, and then down here I normally put the shoes that are not in season. So now I had winter boots and I'm gonna swap it with summer shoes and then I want to get rid of some shoes because I think there is a few that I haven't been wearing in a really long time so it doesn't make any sense to keep it so okay so bags are all organized I keep everything in boxes and dust bags I know like many people get rid of the boxes but um, I don't like my stuff to get all dusty so basically I have um, handbags here um, and then I have here all sneakers and trainers kind of like loafers uh, boots and then here well I have the Balenciaga Triple S because the box is so huge that it just doesn't fit anywhere. And these are all shoes that, you know, I, I'm not sure if I want to keep them, but then I still don't want to get rid of them. So for now they're there. And then here is the like sandals. Now, if you see my previous closet tour, I normally do like Polaroids of my designer shoes. And so I need to get that updated. I don't have time today. Oh, and here is some designer shoes and bags that I'm selling. And we're going to put them on eBay as soon as we have time. And I'm off to pick up them now. Okay, I'm quite happy on how this turned out. Ooh. It fits all my necklaces. I step back so you can see it better and then normally of course I would keep it like this and you can walk through and come and pick your necklaces of the day perfect this is I think is the cheapest solution I could find and the most organized as well and then, these is our, all the boxes that I'm getting rid of, some jewelry that I'm throwing away really because it faded. And these are the other two boxes from Ikea as well, uh, where I put all my rings. I thought like initially this wasn't enough for all my rings, but look, I still have space. And then I put, uh, I think this, it was meant for necklaces. So, um, I have the um, shell necklaces there, but then I put basically all my earrings and it fit perfectly. And then on this other one, um, I have watches, uh, the big, big earrings, my Celine uh, letter necklace, because I thought maybe it was too heavy to hang. I'm going to put this inside the drawer. I think they fit. Imagine if they don't fit. <laughs> no, they should. So yeah, here I have like a chest of drawer that is from Ikea as well. And I put uh, this tray in here. I still have some space. I think I'll put maybe some sunglasses there. And then nothing at the back because there is not much space left. And then in this other drawer at the moment, there is a lot of sunglasses that uh, I'm going to go through them. And then I'm going to put the other tray here and see what else okay so just for record I, I could only fit a couple of sunglasses there so not much space left or that it makes any difference and then here I put uh, here I put the other tray and then I have all the sunglasses there and this is it with the jewelry organization for now I'm quite happy with it 
it does feel really organized. Okay, we are pretty much done here. I'm gonna show you the end result in a minute. It's Thursday. This thing took quite longer than I expected. Like yesterday afternoon, when I showed you the jewelry organization, like it took me hours to untangle all my necklaces, like shame on me. And I'm so happy that I finally got everything organized. You hear strange noises, it's the cleaning lady. And I told her that I was filming. If she hear me talking like, it was like I'm not crazy. <laughs> but I think what I do now, I take you out of the tripod and I'm gonna show you the um, end result. I hope that this is gonna inspire you uh, or some like way of organizing your closet as well because to be honest, it feels really good. Like now it's like ready to start the fall and winter and uh, it feels really, really good to, you know, get rid of stuff and uh, make space for like new things coming for the new season and um, as I said it took longer than I expected but it was a very in the end relaxing process I really like to organize my closet <laughs> okay so let's do a quick final tour uh, excuse my hair but I have a hairdresser appointment tomorrow morning and today I have nothing planned we're just gonna be home so I didn't do much with it <laughs> <laughs> stay home hair. Here I didn't do much besides like refolding some bits and I still have um, summer tops here because the weather is really unpredictable at the moment like one day is 24 degrees the other day is 15 so I think for a couple of weeks I might still use uh, these tops so I haven't moved them um, at the back yet t-shirts uh, summer tops, uh, this is like cotton sweater, so no wool, like so something that is like mid-season. The knitwear that I was using uh, the most at the end of winter, so it was there. And then here, wait, here I have um, all my knits, um, that yeah, to be honest, this pile at the back is not really reachable, but this is the space that I have to deal with. And this is all really nice knits that um, I want to keep. So those are staying there. And then I have here hanging all my jeans and trousers divided. I divide them by color. So if I look for like white jeans, I just uh, have to take out this hanger, for example. And then I have here shorts and skirts and then the rest I showed you like all the bags and shoes uh, shirts with jewelry <laughs> so proud of this <laughs> and then down here I have summer dresses and some long and midi skirts quite some space left and like some spare hangers of stuff that I got rid of with the coats blazers and uh, that's it really. I never really reached the point that I have to get rid of a, of a lot of stuff or like I have to do like a huge clear out. This was more about reorganizing because uh, as you see in the beginning my closet was quite in a state and I couldn't live or work like this anymore. So yeah it was more about like reorganizing and especially my jewelry and I'm really happy with the end result. I really hope that this was helpful girls. If you have any questions just let me a comment and don't forget to subscribe to the channel, uh, give me a thumb up and I'll see you on Wednesday with a weekly vlog. Bye!